June 2014, Islamic State took control of Iraq's second largest city, Mosul, before declaring a caliphate across Iraq and Syria. The jihadist organization and its leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi took the world by surprise. But the groups existed under various names for more than a decade, born during the US-led invasion of Iraq, which ousted Saddam Hussein in 2003. Jordanian Abu Masab al-Zarqawi played a key role in the insurgency against US-led forces and the mainly Shiite politicians who seized power. Zarqawi pledged allegiance to Osama bin Laden and established al-Qaeda in Iraq. His aim was to return Sunnis to power in Iraq and establish an Islamic state. Zarqawi was killed in 2006. Al-Qaeda in Iraq became the Islamic State in Iraq, but lost momentum rejected by local Sunni tribes. The Syrian civil war revived the group, now under the leadership of Baghdadi, a veteran of the anti-American rebellion. In 2013, he proposed a merger with the Al-Nusra Front, active in Syria. But Al-Nusra refused and in 2014, Al-Qaeda severed links with his organization. The split did little to slow the rapid ascent of Baghdadi and his new Islamic State in Iraq and Syria, renamed Islamic State later in the year. But IS continues to exert its influence across large swathes of territory and fiercely defends its strongholds in Mosul in Iraq and Raqqa in Syria. Spectacular attacks against its proclaimed enemies, both near such as Turkey and far such as France and Belgium, together with gruesome footage of hostages being murdered, are now hallmarks of IS tactics.